In the previous class, you have studied what are the uses of food and this cooked food, uncooked food, what is a balanced diet, what are vegetarians and non-vegetarians, isn't it? Now, today we can study what are the good food habits, okay? Which are the good food habits? Which are the good food habits? That is, eat fresh fruits and vegetables. Eat fresh fruits and vegetables. You don't eat overripe fruits. What will happen if you eat overripe fruits? The flies will be sitting on that. And if you eat that, you will get diseases. Okay? So, eat fresh fruits and vegetables. Okay? And while you are eating these fruits and vegetables, you must have to wash it thoroughly. Okay? So, eat washed fresh fruits and vegetables. Okay? That is the first one. The next one, it is don't keep the food open. Okay? Always if you have, uh, cook the food means you must have to close it. What will happen if you keep the food open? The flies will be coming, sitting on that and if you eat that food, that will be, that food will be getting into your stomach and you will be getting diseases. So, you must have to close the food. Okay? Whenever you have uh, prepared the food, you keep it close. Next one. You must have to wash your hands and mouth before eating and after it. Okay? Wash your hands and mouth before and after it. Okay? Next one. You must have to chew the food properly and then eat. Don't swallow it. Okay? You chew the food properly. Is it clear? Then, you must avoid junk food. Which are the junk foods? Junk foods are this burger, pizza, ice cream, fried foods, etc. Are these junk foods. Okay, once in a month, it's okay. But don't practice it regularly. Is it clear? Then, drink plenty of water. That is 6 to 8 liters of water you should have. Drink it. While drinking, you drink boiled water. Is it clear? So, these are some of the good food habits. So, I'll tell you once more which are the good food habits. First one, it is eat fresh fruits and vegetables and also while you are eating, you must have to wash it and then eat it. Then, you must have to eat these uh, 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 fresh fruits. Okay. Then, next one, it is uh, wash your hands before and after eating. Then, don't Keep the food open. You chew the food properly. Don't swallow it. And avoid junk foods. Then drink plenty of water. And also drink boiled water. Okay. These are the things that which you must have. Which are the good food habits. Now we have completed this lesson. Now all of you take your textbook page number 12. Okay. In this you have seen match the following. Did you see that? Okay. Then we can do it. First one. Milk. You write the number like this. Okay. One. Milk. Then. While matching don't draw a line. You put the same number. Okay. Look at the slide and see it. So milk. Then cow. In place of cow you mark number one. Second one, egg, hen, mark number two. Third, sugar, sugar cane, mark number three. Honey, it's done for you. Even then you write number four, honey bee. Fifth one, fish, C, mark five. Sixth, rice, paddy, write number six. Next, Take page number 14. There, did you see that? Draw a smiling face for a good food habits and a crying face for a bad food habits. Did you see that? Either you can draw the smiling face or you can put a tick and a cross. Okay? A tick for smiling face and a cross for a crying face. Okay, we can do it. Wash hands and mouth before and after eating. What is it? Tick. 
chat while eating cross eat fruits without washing cross eat a lot of fried food items cross swallow food cross never eat food kept open tick do not keep food items in the pocket tick drink 6 to 8 glasses of water every day tick drink boiled water tick eat food several times a day cross eat and drink slowly tick read while eating cross chew the food well tick eat colored and flavored food cross eat while watching television cross okay next we can move on to the next exercise that is page number 15 what are the uses of the following here you have seen the picture isn't it here you must have to write down in the column what is the use of that first one what is it it is induction cooker isn't it what is the use it is used for cooking second one purifier it is used for purifying water then kettle boiling water then refrigerator to avoid spoiling food okay you can write in these columns next one let's arrange in order did you see that arrange the following activities in order you must have to arrange it here it is given few points are given here you must have to arrange which is the activity in the correct order these are the activities which is given you must have to arrange it first one what is it brushing the teeth first we will brush the teeth next one washing the face after brushing we will wash the face then bathing then washing mouth and hands then eating so last one it is eating so thus we have finished all our activities and one more thing that i want to tell you is you must have to do it by yourself that is on page number 13 there is uh, identify the food items hidden in the following grid you do it by yourself and write the names okay and that's all finished our uh, portion and the next class i'll give you question and answer thank you